Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Aquarius November 30, 2022. Today's transits stir your desire to set goals and focus on your priorities. You're communicating or studying in personal interests with more intensity. People are drawn to you magnetically now, although there could be missed connections. Conversations, ideas, and interests tend to bring you with someone today. A trine between Mars and Saturn adds a practical bent to the day's energies. With this influence, the best way to make progress is step by step, patiently, and determinately. Skipping steps doesn't serve your interests right now. Try to breathe calmly today and tomorrow. Everyone will be feeling on edge and fired up. Fiery Mars, the red planet of war and aggression, will be causing havoc in the skies and launch a strategic attack on mental Mercury, our cosmic messenger planet. Conflicts around ideas, promises, and long-term plans could explode in your face with everyone out for blood. Don't engage in this wicked behavior, and try to be your calm, collected, and fair-minded self rather than taking on the mantle of a demon. This will ensure that there is a way to damage control. How far can your creative skills go? As of right now, you may have a few professional paths and opportunities to toy with. It could involve travel, education, and gaining a new experience. Since Saturn in Aquarius trines Mars retrograde in Gemini, it might be best to focus on whatever makes you feel happy while playing into your skills. You do not have to decide or commit to one pursuit over another right now. Play around with different ideas, and do not be afraid to experiment with your professional options. Seven days after the sun not only left your income sector but wrapped up a month-long visit that played host to two eclipses, chances are you have more clarity than you did this time last week. As you make sense of a wealth of information and the distance you now have from a total lunar eclipse two weeks ago, there is a new sense of clarity on both sides of the financial fence. If you find yourself giving in to other people too much because you feel they depend on you, it's time to give yourself the attention you deserve and stop distracting yourself through filling the needs of others. Ground yourself with deep breathing exercises. Have you been getting regular aerobic exercise? Take it easy if it's been a while, but definitely try to get back into caring for yourself first. Consider starting something new today. Today's vibration that's occurring, and this fosters new experiences and adventure. Perhaps you've been thinking of taking a course or enrolling in a program of some sort. Perhaps you've been considering a trip to someplace new. Whatever the case, act on these considerations today. Check out what you need to do to make them happen, and then get started. See what you can learn and discover by engaging in the different and even unusual. Whether it is Jupiter in his first full week in direct motion in your work sector or Neptune in his final days in retrograde motion here, they are both at a standstill and are also calling for a wait-and-see approach ahead of the moon's return tomorrow. This gives you a chance to not only embrace today's playful and creative lunar vibes but their direct link to a friendly aspect between Saturn here and Mars in retrograde motion in an adventurous part of your chart. Mars and Saturn have joined forces to declare war on a life that is all work and no play. Right in the heart of a friendly aspect between Saturn on the romantic and Mars on the adventurous front, today's romantically charged lunar vibes are helping to amplify the impact while drawing you in emotionally. There will be a strong mix of nostalgia, romance, passion and adventure in the air all week but the moon is only in your romantic sector until tomorrow. Our eyes in the sky. The cosmic climate is challenging today as the Aquarius moon allies with Saturn while also butting heads with Mercury, Venus and Mars. The energy here can put your will at odds with your emotions, making it difficult to know which way you should move forward. You might also feel weighed down and unmotivated as these funky vibes wash over everyone. Meanwhile, stubborn behaviors are likely to manifest, so you'll want to watch out for these in both yourself and others. Tension will hang in the air, so if you feel like you need a timeout, permit yourself to take one. You're able to keep track of the things that matter, managing to take control and concentrate on what's important to you. 
Such an optimistic approach positively affects your personal life, helping you to resolve any potential problems you must deal with and uncover the true significance of your relationships and exactly the direction they are heading. Your ability to understand any situation is good and you're able to undertake any sort of mental task. Equally, you're communicating without any difficulty, so possible negotiations or similar conversations turn out to be successful. You also find your general level of curiosity is heightened and you're keen to acquire knowledge and learn as much as you can. Your thoughts have seldom been so lucid and in harmony. Problems with relationships that seemed insurmountable just a short time ago are now resolved without further arguments. The time has come to revive personal bonds. Enjoy this phase and experience life with other people. The memories will last for a long time. Don't be surprised by certain situations and dating opportunities that crop up. There's plenty to contemplate and consider in the coming weeks before you make any decisions. Think about the how you want to allow your heart to be directed. Showing good sense assures time spent isn't wasted and for nothing. In the evening, we'll see more rocky vibes as the moon shares a harsh aspect with unpredictable Uranus. This energy threatens to challenge what we usually feel we can rely on, which can lead to destabilization and strained emotions. Just after midnight, the Aquarius moon sextals the Sagittarius sun, granting us inner peace and confidence. If we are awake, our strong sense of self will facilitate authentic connections with others. We celebrate the quirkier sides of our personalities, forging relationships based on niche interests and shared dreams. If we are asleep, we can expect uplifting dreams where novel experiences shift our perspective in affirming ways. What interests you most is of a positive nature and helps you gain insight into many new issues and make progress at every opportunity. These encounters stimulate the exchange of ideas that provide numerous sources of inspiration. Ideas to make your relationship more interesting, or opportunities to travel and broaden your horizons. After sunup, Mars in Gemini trines Saturn in Aquarius, the second of three trines in Mars retrograde cycle. These transits create a narrative arc that supports tempering our passions so we can focus our willpower. The first of these trines occurred on September 27 with Mars in direct motion. Think back to this date. Was there a project kicked off around this time that you have since lost momentum on? This trine reminds you that although a redesign may be in order, this project is still viable. In fact, it is destined for success, despite false starts. What steps can you take at this point to push this enterprise along? You're allowed to get experimental in your process. Think outside the box. Take a few risks. Defy a few expectations. The final trine between Mars and Saturn will be on March 30, 2023, after Mars enters Cancer and Saturn enters Pisces.